How's it going everybody? Raising Hell here and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the mini monument and the pirate birdcage secret skins in Don't Starve Together. I'm sure plenty of you out there are already aware of how these two items are acquired but uh, at the same time there are plenty of people who probably haven't been as active on the forums and stuff and since these two skins in particular are not heavily advertised I think it makes sense to make other people aware of them because both of them are neat little rewards for buying a couple of other DLCs from Don't Starve. So the mini monument and the pirate birdcage are both loyal rewards. Here is what you're going to need to do to redeem them. First of all, you're going to need two DLCs here for Don't Starve, both Reign of Giants and Shipwrecked. Both of these DLCs come with their own product code, and you can find out what that product code is simply by right-clicking on Don't Starve in your Steam library, and in the context menu that comes up, click View CD Key. This will open up a window that lists the game, as well as all of its DLCs, and the product code for each of them. Now, for the mini monument, you're going to need the key or product code from Don't Starve Reign of Giants, and for the pirate bird cage, you're going to need the product code from Don't Starve Shipwrecked. It is relatively easy to move this code into the game, as you can simply select it here in this menu and click copy key to keyboard. If you want to make sure that you actually have copied this key to the keyboard, bring up something like notepad, paste your computer's clipboard into there, and just double check it before actually going into the game. Once you have this code, simply log in to Don't Starve Together, click the redeem button in the lower left hand side of the main menu, and here you'll be able to paste your code. Now there are a total of five little boxes for each like each segment of the code. You don't have to worry about that, just control V, just paste it all in there, and press submit. Now for purposes of demonstration here, I only redeemed the shipwrecked code because I had previously redeemed to my Don't Starve Together account, the Reign of Giants DLC code. But as you can see here, once the key is successfully redeemed, you'll get a present, and when you open it, it will be either the mini monument or the pirate birdcage based on which key for which DLC you redeem. Now it's important to note here that according to pretty much all reports that I've seen, these rewards are still available if you buy Don't Starve DLC right now. You don't have to worry about having to be grandfathered in by buying it before this promotion went live. Uh, there have have been some people who reported problems actually getting these codes to work, but I think that's simply because sometimes Clay has to renew or add additional rewards to the back end of the game. I don't think it's actually intended that people who buy the game now are going to miss out because everything I've seen is to the contrary with a few rare exceptions, as I pointed out, but I'm sure Clay went ahead and fixed that for the people who are having or experiencing difficulties redeeming these codes. So once you've gone ahead and redeemed both of these items, you might be interested in checking them out in game. Now, one really interesting thing about these loyal skins is the fact that they don't show up unless you actually have them. So if you take a look at your item collection and don't starve together, you'll never see the potential loyal skins that you could get, right? You only see the ones that you have. And that's certainly the case here with the mini monument and the pirate birdcage. So if you previously hadn't been aware that these existed, you would not know where to look to get them, right? Because when browsing through the item collection, it wouldn't show up there if you didn't already have them. When using them in practice, they behave much like any other skin in the game would. The pirate birdcage is used as an alternative skin for the standard birdcage and don't starve together. When crafting, simply click the little selection buttons to the right or to the left to select the pirate birdcage before prototyping it. And the same applies to the mini monument as well. So these are a couple of what I would consider to be secret skins. There obviously have been other tutorials and stuff done about them, but Clay is not necessarily overt in marketing these items as available to people who purchase Reign of Giants and Shipwreck DLC for Don't Starve. Single player. So overall, I feel that these are a couple of items that everybody who owns those aforementioned DLCs should take advantage of redeeming. Uh, if you don't own the formerly mentioned DLCs, certainly go and check them out. There's some cool items in it for people who play Don't Starve Together as well, because I know some people don't like Don't Starve Single Player, but the, you can see here, you're rewarded a little bit for actually buying some of Clay's other games with in-game content for Don't Starve Together. So it's pretty cool. That's pretty much all I have to say on the subject. Thank you very much for watching as always, and I hope to see you next time.